saw the link with Doja Cat was live and she was listening to, of all things, a little brother record in the background, whatever you say. Whatever you say. And she's giving, she's going on and on. Well, she's rapping the verse. Literally rapping the verse, but then she goes on a tangent about how cold the verse is, how it didn't rhyme, which we've all... Hey, Mm -hmm. put him on the song. Don't be like Drake. (laughs) Thank you. Uh... And she was giving them peas, and I saw Fonte repost it, and, uh, and Pooh reposted it as well. And, like, she was calling Fonte a legend and all this type of stuff. And I, that that was a good moment, for, especially coming off of what Little Brother just went through with the, you know, the listing and, I mean, not the listing, uh, the Mr. Show and the Wax and all the stuff they had with ABB. It was really good. I felt good seeing them get peas. I guess I didn't know Doja Cat would be the, you know, way they got. Mm, got some flowers, but I ain't mad at it. They got. I, the I don't flowers. even hate Doja Cat like that. Nah, I don't listen to her music like that, so I'm not that familiar. But I understand the story. I mean, I know, just, she, I know she was in racial chat room showing, showing feet. feet, showing feet. But, but, but at the same time, she's just trying to get that money. You know, Jay Moore. So. Man. <laughs> Jay, <laughs> Jay Moore, what, you had a point about that, man. You want to kind of explain well, no, it before because, we got out of here? Because for for a quick minute, they yeah. were trying to get Doja Cat. It's another, it's, this is once again how you can't cancel anybody mm-hmm. because you cannot, you cannot destroy what you did create. Okay. And Doja Cat is a perfect example of that. The people who like her music were not ready to get her out of here. Yeah. So they were like, okay, we cause like, even when I try to do the research and the science on what it was, I was like, okay, this is weird, Yeah, but we're not going to get her out of here, uh, you know? And, she knows, she knows, feet. You know, she knows how to make records well, for, says, for, for for the top 40, and she yeah. knows how to, to get down on, on a record with, you know, with Sweetie and French Montana. I mean, she videos actually, of her breakdancing and stuff, can, like, hey, back in the day. Actually, like, and low-key, maybe not low-key, she, she can actually rap. Yeah, she like, can. you know, she, she she she's she like good a, music. I know, she's she's yeah, like a B-girl, you know what I'm saying? And so There's videos of her breakdancing. It's not really surprising to me to know that she would know who little brother is. Yeah. Right. I understand why it's like that for other people because yeah. like she's, and the thing is she, before even she got her mainstream look, she had been putting out music. Everybody yep. hears, you know, the cow, the cow song. Yeah. That's uh, what I, yeah. And, and then, you know, that was her first look and she did that almost as a joke. Yeah. But you know what, this things that you do as a joke could really get you I put mean, on. That put that her was on. The moment. I'm but, talking about on. And it, and it got her. And then when it was time for her to put out, you know, yeah. a, Cheeks song. out too, yeah. So when she put out the the, the <laughs> juicy record, you know what I'm saying. Some of y'all know what I'm talking yeah, about, you're right? Though you know it was t- it was it was go time. You know, yeah. once again, that's that's we talked what, about it last week we, when we talked about like party B. If you're going, but we, uh, even we, even when we talked about how you know if you are going to, I'm not going to say she was trading, um, uh, uh, dignity for attention. Nah, but honestly, if there are people who see it like that. It worked for her because she had albums out. She had something for us to latch on to. And then she after, was ready to go. She had that, something tangible. After that Definitely. moment passed, okay, she hit the ground running. You yep. know, it just wasn't a situation to where we were like, oh, yeah, remember that song about uh, the cows? Yeah. You know, and we're looking up two years later. Like, that was really funny. It's and, like, crazy I wonder that what nobody she's even doing talks now. about that song. No. Yeah. She has so many hits on the radio and stuff yeah. now that the cow song is. People don't even I mean, it's out that. there, but. It's a, I mean, it's a distant memory. It ain't even a so. Is it associated with her at this point? I mean, like, she just did hey. it the right way. Yeah. Okay. She, did it. she, you know, like in the same sense, like it's like I, I've talked about it for the last few weeks. So I guess I'll bring it up again. It's like having your content and then being able to do what you do. Like she was just, she was able to find a viral moment that that she knew what to do when it happened. Mm-hmm. She was able to press gas. And she, as, soon and she, as, as soon as it happened, she was able to press gas and, and it was like, off. oh, you know, ready. I got this over here. I got yeah, these yeah. two albums and then yep. I got this coming too. Like Lone yep. said, being ready in that moment though. Yep. That's, you got to keep the momentum. Yeah. Got to keep the momentum. The thing about Little Brother though is what we're finding out and we're not strangers to this but it's an episode of your favorite artist favorite artist yep. yeah yeah because there's so many people that put little brother up on a pedestal but they haven't given them that look to Dude, actually the put the shine on that they need now, i don't even know if they really want it but there's certain artists hint hint that right. that could have thank you because they gave him a bone so you should return that once you get to a certain level. I'm yep. just saying. Terry, there was an interview with uh, that that 
Fonte and Pooh did. A couple of them were floating around, you know, on the, the tour for the last, or the press run for the last album. And somebody asked him about that. May the Lord watch. Yeah, may the Lord watch. And he was like, at this point, it's like, he's cool with it. And he didn't really expect anything. He's, but he did say the fans are still mad about it. Like what you just said. Yeah. Like, it kind of rubbed we, you the wrong way. We wanted to see, you don't yeah. see somebody gush over somebody and say, oh my God, it's just the biggest inspiration. And we grew up on y'all. And I used to listen to this. I used to listen to that. And then become the artist that Drake became and not throw one bone back. One live. As, that a, don't sit right with a, me. A posthumous uh, Michael Jackson feature on your joint. Oh yeah, yeah. And, but Fonte that everybody looks up to, obviously. But I mean, you said that little brother was like your favorite. Yeah, and you have not given them that. Like you've had time. You you had time to make uh, a record with Fetty Wap. You had yeah. time to make yeah. a record with with, with yeah. Dirk and them. You know, you've had time to make records with everybody except the person people you say. Yeah, time inspired really, you. You really and really set the Birth table your for style. you. Hey, really set the table for and you. Crazy, and what's crazy? And threw your bond on comeback. And here, yep. and here, here's what. But I chuckled at this part of the interview, and he couldn't remember it, but he kept saying it over and over again. He was like, "Lord, Lord, something." It turns out that he has a verse for the Lord knows, but it never came out. Fonte has a verse. He said, "I believe the song was called Lord Something." And the reporter, Lord was knows, like, that that was probably on uh, the second. The Just Blaze beat. Yeah, that's that. Uh, <clears throat> is he said he, he said it ended up being Lord knows, but. They put Ross in there and something happened with the timing. But I can only imagine Fonte bodying Drake on Lord Lord Knows. Mm. I can only imagine what that sounds like. So, I mean, we'll probably never hear it. But he did mention, he's like, I think it ended up being Lord Knows, mm -hmm. which would have been nuts if you'd have heard Fonte, you know what I'm saying, on that beat, especially with the breakdown and how it changes and the, the chords and everything. But it's got to be an interesting dynamic, too. Like, I, I mean, don't I, don't I, I, don't, I don't know what it's like to be Drake and to like want to go back and work with a whole bunch of people too. You know what I mean? I, I don't know what that's like. I'm trying to give him a little bit of the benefit of the doubt, but, <laughs> but yeah, I, I don't know. I like, I don't, I don't know what that would be like. I mean, like they're still relevant though. I mean, they're, I mean, they're still fine. doing music. It's not, like they're they're fine. Not, yeah, it's not yeah. like they're irrelevant. It's like, it's, it's not like some, like, it's not a charity case for you to be like, yeah. man, Fonte, what's up? The, the, it's not the, that. This is what bothers me about it, I guess. Like a Black Rob like, situation or something? I don't, I don't dislike Drake at all. I like Drake. Mm -hmm. Nah, but Drake is dope. I don't, I don't think that the, the meter is going to turn any which way from him. By by giving that's true uh, Fonte or a big pool of feature on he his could album. do Drake could do a Russ like album and he would do nothing but probably gain fans yeah 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 he's not gonna he's, lose he's any gonna gain, he's gonna gain the fans that yeah. that kind of want to like him yeah but won't like him because he's not yeah hip hop yeah, per he se. doesn't write his own stuff. as yeah. as relevant as as relevant or you know it's subjective but as we say little brother still is because they are they they still are out there it would benefit Fonte dropped a classic album solo joint yeah like but, what two but three would, years ago to me it would benefit still it would be able to benefit them if you get fonte and big poo on Anything. a studio drake i don't care what i don't care if it's a mixtape like but in you today's know, era i think that would do them well drake still has handlers and people who <laughs> he want, has handlers and, you know there's still people <laughs> A, you know, at his record label, of like, okay, now we have to strategically put this here and we have to do this. And like, why would you put, who are these, who is, you know, it was just like at one point, um, certified lover boy sounds, they like were that. trying to, you know, they were trying to do something at Def Jam yeah. and, um, and this is in the nineties and somebody said, Hey, why don't we get, uh, the Fugees on the record? And Lior Cohen is like, who are the Fugees? Hmm. Right. You know, cause at that point, really who were the Fugees? This is before the score. So there are people who work in these offices and make these decisions and guide, you know, superstars career is like, why would you do that with them when we can get you on uh, a record with future? Yeah. We, we'll, we'll take five more future records before we even, uh, uh, even think about doing and a record. We, and we know they Fonte. sound, we know they're going to sound the exact and, same. And they'll as sound they'll the exact for. same and all five of them will play on the radio. Yeah. Like, why yeah. would we take a risk with you doing any work with these people that we don't even like, mm -hmm. you gotta understand these people who work you put these, Yabba on it. Yeah, these people, I fool with Yabba. Yeah, but you I know, know these people who work in, in these offices, they're not fans of music. And so they don't care. Hey Drake, I'm going to be honest with you though. I thought we, 
I tip my hat for you giving Yeba an interlude. Yeah, uh, that's on, dope. On that album. That, heard, that is a good look. That is a good look. But I heard that Kanye washed him at the uh, Free Hoover joint. I didn't stay up to watch it. I, I saw it. Either. How can you get washed at a concert? I don't know. <laughs> I guess the the play, the play Kanye's version of the show was I tell you, Eon's better People turn than everything Drake's. into a oh, competition. They do. Like they thought is, this right. was not a versus. 